If you are experiencing a delay, because when you're waiting on something, your whole focus is on what you're waiting on. So what you have to do to keep from being discouraged through the delay is that you have to find things right now that you can appreciate. What is it that's happening in my world right now that I can appreciate? Create the habit sometimes of just listing three things each day for which you are thankful. It's difficult to search for things each day for which you are thankful and to be disillusioned by a delay at the same time. So you have to learn how to, to keep your encouragement up, keep your hope up, keep your faith up, because there is always joy in the moment, find it. There is joy in the moment. I know not everything is perfect. I know you haven't gotten the, 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 the dream job yet. You haven't found the dream person yet in your life, your dream mate, and you don't have the dream house or the dream. Listen, but while you're on your way to getting those things, find something in the moment that you can rejoice on. You know, I just get blessed when I go into a, a particular establishment and people are working and it's not the best paying job. And I find people on the job clowning and having a time of their life. And sometimes, I mean, I get blessed by seeing them having a good time at work. Yeah. And, I, and I will say to them, I said, you guys are having a little too much fun to be working. <laughs> I mean, you're getting paid. Listen, find joy in the moment. Find joy in the moment. Happy workers make happy customers. Uh, you, you know, there's no need. Don't wait until you get off of work to start laughing. Find something to laugh about while you're at work, and it'll shorten the appearance of the time. If it's just ah, time to make the donuts, time to make the donuts. If I'm going to make the donuts, I want to make the donuts working next to crazy Shirley, who's going to make me laugh and going to be dancing and getting her groove on and doing all, saying all kind of stuff. I want to, you know, I want to work beside somebody who knows how to find joy in the moment. Don't just start rejoicing as soon as you, you know, I mean, an hour before it's time to get off of work, and then you, that last hour, you're just counting down. You know, uh, businesses. I, I really want to tell businessmen. Business owners, you may as well just go ahead and shut out an hour early anyway because your folks have already checked out. <laughs> They're already packing up, getting the stuff, you know. I mean, I know I used to work in retail and, and uh, you know, when, when it was close to closing time, we, we almost didn't want anybody to come in the store. <laughs> Here comes somebody and it's almost time for you to get in and then they just rushing like, <laughs> trying to let you know that, and I'm like, listen, I've already counted my register down. <laughs> I got my stuff at the door. I am ready to go. Do you know what time we close? And here you come running in here five minutes before. I had already checked out nearly an hour before it was time for me to leave. I'm, I'm already gone. I'm already, I'm almost off of work. But let me just tell you, learn to find joy in the moment. Find some bodies, find a, 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 this place where you go off to. I mean, if you have to go to the bathroom and use your imagination <laughs> just to have your happy time. I mean, we, we had one, one young lady and my dad would use such strong, strong language with her and, and poor little thing, she'd, 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 she'd just cry. She'd cry all morning because he'd, he'd be just giving her shade all morning long. <laughs> and at lunchtime, She'd be in the bathroom 20, 30 minutes. And it took me some years to realize she was in there smoking weed. Because <laughs> for the rest of the afternoon, my daddy would say something to her. She laughed all afternoon long. She was laughing all afternoon. All afternoon. He could say things that wouldn't make her cry in the morning, but in the afternoon, she would. <laughs> Now, I am not advocating getting high on the job. Please. You do know this is not Colorado. You do understand that. And we are the people of God. You have to find legal ways to be able to enjoy yourself. Now, I, wouldn't it be wonderful? Wouldn't it be absolutely wonderful if you got to choose the people that you work with? Can you imagine 
what a difference it would make at work if you really love working with the people that you're working with. Because when you're with people that you really enjoy, it doesn't seem like work. Amen. There is joy in the moment. Find it. Find it. Until you arrive, find it. I mean, I can remember, you know, growing up, you know, we used to put on our parents' clothes. We didn't, you know, we had all sons. I had all brothers. And so we'd sometimes put on daddy's oversized clothes, just, just playing him. It, it, it just helped us to feel good in the moment. In the moment. You have to use your imagination to feel good in the moment while things are being delayed. Because, you know, when you're a child, it looks like you'll never grow up. It looks like you'll just never grow up. When you're in school, it looks like you'll never get out of school. But find things that you can enjoy in the moment and learn to do those. Discover legal ways. Did I, did I say legal? <laughs> to have fun on your job. And learn to be in the moment. Learn to be, whoever you, be with whoever you're with. Learn to be in the moment and enjoy the moment. So that when the devil is trying to tempt you to quit because of a delay, learn to find pleasure in the moment. Pleasure in the moment. There is pleasure in the moment. You know, that's one of the reasons that I, I, I love to be able to come into the presence of God. There are some things that you can get in God's presence that you can't get anyplace else. I mean, in, in His presence, at His right hand, you know, there are pleasures forevermore, forevermore. I mean, the world has pleasure. The world can give you pleasure, but it's not forevermore. It's until the thrill is gone. But there are pleasures at his right hand forevermore. There, there's something that you get in the presence of God that you can't get anyplace else. While you're waiting on a delay, get into his presence. If you can't find it with the people that you're with, find it in him. Tap into him. Right in the presence of God. Right in the, I mean, if you have to excuse yourself and go to the bathroom and, and, and go into your secret language, just to connect with your father and find joy there just to keep from losing your mind up in here, up in here. 